Let's talk about Polkadot's architecture. I know this graph looks intimidating, but I'm going to go with you slowly. So this entire ecosystem, you can consider it as Polkadot. And this dark gray chain here, that's the relay chain. And you can consider that as Polkadot's blockchain. Now, there's these other slots here called Parachain slot and Parachain bridge slot. And so I'm going to be talking about the Parachain slot. This would be the port where I enter my Parachain and adapts would be hosted on here. And there's only a hundred of these pair chains. However, a pair chain can also become a relay chain. A pair chain slot is active 24 seven. So it's really meant for dApps with high transactions. And here's a pair thread pool. And the only difference between a pair thread and a pair chain is the fact that pair thread goes through a pay as you go model and a pair chain, you just buy one. Adapt that would be good on Parathread pool would be adapt that doesn't use that many transactions. So you can consider Parathread to be a dorm where let's say there's only one phone to use. Everybody's sharing that one phone. However, on a parachain, it's just a private phone.